Hello everyone. In this short video, we're going to install the Jupyter Notebook extensions. So first, we'll begin by going to the Navigator and the Anaconda Navigator, and we're going to go to the Environment section. I've created another environment where I'm going to install the same. So first, I will launch the terminal, and then I will type in the command that is available on the Jupyter Contrib NB extensions library page. We have two ways. Obviously, the pip is one way, but since we have Anaconda, we're going to choose the Conda installation, and I'm going to pick this particular line to install it. I copied the code, and now I'm going to paste it here, and say Enter. Do you want to continue installation? I'll say yes, and it'll finally start the installation. So once the installation is done, now we'll go on to Anaconda Navigator and I'm going to go to the home page from the Environments tab and launch Jupyter Notebook. So once that's launched, I'm going to go to the document section, the folder where I am doing this installation and I'm going to choose the Jupyter Notebook extension installation. Now here we'll experiment whether the in extension installation happened or no. But first let's look at what happened within the Jupyter Notebook when we first launch it. You'll notice that you'll have this NB extensions tab, right? So uh, obviously all of this is disabling all of the extensions here, but if you want to enable all of them, you uncheck it and all of these things will be enabled, right? The only ones that will be enabled are the ones that will be checked and we can try to experiment on some of them and see how they're going to be working. So let's begin with the table beautifier. First, let's check out the table without the extension help. I'm going to import pandas and I'm going to load the iris data set and let's see the table. Now it's going to be this particular table where it's going to show the top five rows and the bottom five rows and the column names that are available here. Now I'm going to close this and I'm going to enable the table beautifier go back to the files menu and open the notebook again. I'm going to import pandas again, read the iris data set and then rerun the data table that we have here. And you'll notice that this change has occurred, right? Where I can sort the data with all of these options, right? So this is one simple change that we can make to the Jupyter Notebook extensions and we'll be able to beautify the table in a much more neater way. Another useful extension is the hinterland. Now, many of you might be wondering how to do the autocomplete within Anaconda or the Jupyter Notebook. So you can select this hinterland option. I'm going to close this notebook and reopen it. And let's see how this is going to work. So if I type, if I import pandas as PD, import numpy, or nump right enter as np is now going to be coming in and loading there right so this is a very useful extension for basically doing autocomplete within python notebooks apart from that there are some other extensions that are very helpful you can go ahead and explore some of these options there are the scroll down option the snippets option or the table of contents options which are very useful for you to be more efficient working with Python notebooks. I hope you like this video guys on how to install the NB Jupyter Notebook extensions and enhance the way that you work with Python notebooks. Thank you for watching this video guys. Please hit the like button and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel.